Yo, 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 big kiss back up in here, man. They saying Drake record label ain't filling them 100 gigs, man. All the little video footage he dropping and all that, man. They said they ain't feeling that. They say, he, man, shh. His own label sick of his head. He losing all that money. Man, let's see what let's see what's going on, man. Y'all know I'm like holding y'all without further ado. Let's get 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 it. And hey, these labels, you know, as we talk about these artists and how much they're bosses and they have this and third, man, we all we all realize the labels are the real true bosses. Uh Drake's Finsta just posted that. You know, he's been posting a bunch of unreleased, like, you know, fr seemingly free music. You know, he dropped 100 gigs, but he's been posting a bunch of stuff. So he posted something to his Instagram, right? And it was supposedly like some unknown, unnamed song, but it's one of his songs. And essentially what happened is that Universal Music Group actually put a claim in to take down that song. Now, Drake is putting it up, and it's kind of ironic because it's Drake's song. Drake's putting it up, and his own label is saying, take this down. And I mean, that's why I said, bro, once these people are up under these contracts, they sell their life rights away. They don't own themselves. There's not much to really like kind of like hypothesize about this other than the fact that no matter if you're Drake in this industry and actually, especially if you're Drake in this industry, if you just got four hundred million dollars from a universal music group. Right. And by the way, IFPI is this organization they use for a lot of these takedowns. Trust me, I know. Uh, even if you're Drake in this industry, or especially if you're Drake in this industry, and you've gotten four hundred four hundred million dollar deal, they want to make sure no penny goes accounted for or not right. accounted for. They want to make sure that nobody is playing your music for free. I've always said the 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 protections of Drake's music, the artists of current day. Why? Because Drake's music streams the most. So that's money. That's the most amount of money that this label could possibly get within rap. And they're not going to have people get this music for free. So, again, here's the thing. They're basically telling Drake, no, nigga, we know that you just went through a battle and you're trying to do this little PR <laughs> thing or you're trying to, like, be cool and edgy and drop some. No, uh, nigga, we know you trying to do your little battle stunts. No, you done lost too much money as it is, bro. Don't Some of your down. music for free, but this ain't how it go, buddy. Yeah. You're going to have to send us your music. Damn. Well, not necessarily send us the music, but you, the music has to be policed by us, right? We have you in contract. It's our shit, okay? Right. And when we did our deal, we give you $400 million. It says we have the right to administer uh, um, and, and utilize the rights of your music, even if it means taking it down from your Finsta. Now, I'm pretty sure Drake's going to make one call, and Man. they'll probably stop, right? They won't fuck with that account anymore. Look, he's but still just glazing. Goes, now I'm, pr I'm pretty sure Drake is gonna he's gonna overcome. You know, you know, bruh. Stop. I'm sure Drake, he's gonna uh, it's Drake, you know. No, man, we don't know. Shit. They're gonna fire his ass. <laughs> this thing is still glazing, bruh. It's a show. At, uh, um, Universal Music Group is probably not happy that Drake is releasing for your free music. Now, this is where I think Drake is smart. This dude, like man. very smart. Hey, when who you he get say in was a smart? time like... Who he just say was smart? Please, bro, I will click off this damn video, bro. He bet not have said Drake was smart. I'm clicking off the video, bro. Very smart. Hey, when you... That Drake is releasing for your free music. Now, this is where I think Drake is smart. Like, very smart. Hey, when you That's get in a time bad. like where he's at right now, where, like, some people are doubting you culturally... You want to drop music on a SoundCloud. You want to drop music in the middle of the night. You want to almost get back on. It, like, you know, what Drake is doing, that's the new mixtape, right? It's it's like I'm dropping music in a mixtape way where people don't feel like it's an official release, but I'm still feeding the streets, right? Here's the thing. Universal Music Group don't understand that. They're, they're like, they move like a bot. They're like, all they see is, what, free music? Oh, let's stop this bullshit, right? But in reality... Drake is just giving us free. They don't understand the culture. But being though that Drake been around, he understand. You know what I'm saying? He got people around him that understand. But them big wigs, they don't understand. It. They don't understand. Man. He shit to kind of not only remind us why we fuck with him, but to also kind of feel it out to get the new hit. And whenever the new hit pops off, he's going to announce some crazy shit coming. You know, that's he kind of does it all the time. Fuck, yo. <laughs> 
Bro, you see how this nigga smacking us? He going, he going, mm, mm. he going to hit us in the head with some crazy shit. No, he's not, bro. He's done. He's done. Get, get cute. Let, yeah, let your man get cute. Because I'm ready to hit him on release uh, Kendra joint. I'm ready. Universal Music Group, once again, big labels never understand. What Drake did with 100 gigs <laughs> um, on your head top, that's a smart move. What Drake is doing by trying to tease some of these songs, that's a smart move because, you know, he doesn't want to roll out confidently with a dud. However, Universal Music Group does not understand that, and they show it here when they're issuing takedowns for songs that is not even be able to purchase or he's not releasing the whole song. He's essentially doing a snippet. You know what I mean? I, trust me, I know about this because anytime Drake releases snippets, Universal comes after you. Go ahead and say Drake, your cousin, nigga. We are, that's what you want to say. Act want to say Drake is my cousin. That's what he want to say. If you repost it. I know this is a fact. Okay? When oh, he, man, no. like, he'll do... I, trust me, I know about this because... Anytime Drake releases snippets, Universal comes after you if you repost it. I know this is a fact. Okay? When he, like, he'll do some shit, he'll play some shit in the club. If you repost it on your page and your page is big enough, they're coming to claim it. They're coming to say, take that shit down. That's Drake. You get what I mean? So, uh, Mr. Morgan will probably give a call to Universal uh, Republic people and they'll get this notice kind of handled, most likely. But it just shows even Drake, and this is a true value of independence. Even Drake doesn't have complete autonomy on his own music. And the people who incentivize him to make music with giving him hundreds of millions of dollars, they won't let that nigga, uh, Jewish or not, that light-skinned Negro will not just sit there and just leak all type of free music. You know, again, keep I'm in mind. You, bro, dude, I'm telling you, these people, greet, they got to have all their pennies. These, the, these are the people that's billionaires riding in a 92 Toyota. That's these people. That's these people still living in the two bedroom apartment, boy. Billionaire, two bedroom apartment. I'm fine as long as I have my desk. Like, what do I need? What do I need a mansion for? I'm telling y'all, man. You know who? Um, and by the way, this is an interesting story. I could go down a whole rabbit hole with this one. I won't do it though. Maybe a story for another day. Warren Buffett still living his childhood home. Look it up. Think about it. Who releases the most snippets and just songs randomly? Give me some names in the chat. Let me see if y'all y'all are accurate with it. Drake, Drake, Mad Drake, snippets Drake, and just Drake, drops man. music whenever, and Come it don't on, seem like the, the it feels like the label catches up later. Huh? Who? Come on, give me some names. Snippets. Kendra be releasing nah, snippets Drake. and. And do, not it gonna, and do it later. Uh uh. Not boat. I'm surprised they're not like. He I'm surprised they're not saying joint. it's really one name. Uh, and it should be two names, but one of them should be eliminated for the second thing I said. It's not Cardi because Cardi will drop the snippet, but you never get the song. It's NBA Youngboy. NBA Youngboy will drop a song at 2 a.m. The song will be up on his YouTube, only his YouTube, for like 10 days before it gets on Spotify. So the labels are playing catch up with him. But they never, like, usually, and by the way, he went through those fights with Atlantic. Remember, he used to, like, post in his, like, description, yo, they don't want me to drop me. He went through a lot of fights with them because usually a label don't want you just to drop some shit random sporadically without them get it, without them ingesting it into the system that it could be monetized properly. So, young boy went through that fight with them heavily, right? Like, think about it. Why do yeah, you think I that? Yeah, can't have, you see, all of that. Yeah, we got to tell you what to do and all of that stuff, man. I mean, these rappers is basically working a nine to five job. More than that. More than that. No, we got to tell you when to move, how to move. You know what I'm saying? No, nah, I'm good on that. But yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think of the video. He still found a way to glaze. Still found a way. See, 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 Dre, Dre, see, Dre, let me say, let me tell you something. Drake is going to get through this thing. You understand? Yeah. It, Drake is my cousin. He want to say that so damn bad, bro. Y'all let me know what y'all think of the video. Big Kish signing out. I'm gone, man.